Hi there, you are watching Gizmo Journal. Today, we will learn how to create film style videos using the Wondershare Filmora mobile app, available for both Android and iOS platforms. The tutorial is divided into two parts, and this is the part one. Create a new project to start with. Import your clips to the project. Now the clips here are shot at 16 is to nine aspect ratio, Cinematic videos often maintain a wider aspect ratio, about 21 is to 9, or wider. So we can add cinematic black bars at the top and the bottom of the videos. Open the effects menu, scroll left, and look for the cinematic effects. There are different cinematic border styles, but we will use this basic one only, for the true film style looks. There. The black bars add a cinematic look to the video. Let me stretch the effect overlay to apply it to the other clips in the project. The second most important factor is color grading. So to achieve that film look in our videos, we will adjust different parameters, like tweaking the exposure, adding contrast and saturation, as per the theme of the videos. Now switch to the Filter tab. There you will find a film category, exclusively created for cinematic videos. These filters, or LUTs, can be clicked and you will see a preview in the video player before you actually apply it. So find the best cinematic look without any grading process right in your film or a mobile app. The opacity or intensity of the filters can be adjusted. The selected filter can be applied to all the videos in the project with a single click. There is also an option to check the video before and after applying the filters. Now it's truly looking cinematic. Let me show you other film style filters available in the Filmora app. These are very carefully fine-tuned to express the theme of the film. Even videos shot with your smartphones can get the thousand dollar cinema camera feel and look without any manual color grading. In today's tutorial, I will apply different filters for different clips, depending on the theme, lighting, and subject. Lastly, let us talk about cinematic transitions. Open the transitions menu, I suggest you to mostly use fades and dissolve transitions for cinematic editing. Even though there is a cinematic category, these are suitable for particular type of films. Let me show you some samples. For action movies, we can use these transitions. There are Halloween and superhero movie themed transitions available. So find the transitions suitable for you film style videos. For today's video, we will use simple dissolve transitions and crossfades. I would suggest you to use the same or similar transitions for a single video to maintain the theme, but again, it depends on your video and your editing style. This is the end of the part one. In the second part, we will learn about cinematic titles and film style sound design to complete the cinematic look. So, subscribe to Gizmo Journal and find the second episode in the video notes below.